Hello and many congratulations for completing all the lessons in the First Steps Piano Tutor Book. We're now moving on to the exam sheet itself. If you're interested in taking the examination, you have four requirements. The first requirement is to play two exercises and that is worth 20 marks. Then your next requirement is to play the scale of C major and that's worth 10 marks. Then you select two pieces from a list and they are worth 60 marks. And finally you have theory questions which are worth 10 marks. Now not all the material that's on the exam sheet would be suitable for the requirements that you have already learned within the tutor book. So I'm only going to focus on the exercises and the pieces that cover the techniques that you have learned already in the tutor book itself. So we'll start first of all by having a look at the exercises. And my suggestion is to play exercise one and exercise three. Both of these exercises cover all the notes that you have learnt in the tutor box. So first of all, you'll see that exercise one has got the sign moderato at the top. So you play this at a moderate speed. You can also see you have dynamics in this too. So the first line is a forte, which is loud, and the second line is piano which is quiet. I will now play the piece to you. The exercise three has allegretto as your tempo indication and that means fairly fast. You also have a strange looking C. Now this isn't covered in the tutor box but I will explain what this is now. This C stands for common time which is 4-4 four, four, which also means four crotchets in a bar. You can see in this exercise you start forte loud, go to piano, quiet, stay quiet at bar five, and then finish at forte for the end of the exercise. I will now demonstrate this. the scale of C major in the tutor book. So you will play the scale first of all in your right hand and then also in your left hand. requirement for this exam and that is to play the scale of C major in contrary motion. Now contrary motion means playing in opposite directions. So you start by putting both your thumbs on middle C and then you play the scale as you normally would but going in opposite directions instead. Like this. Now moving on to the pieces, you have as 
one of your pieces, the piece playing tight notes. And this has already been demonstrated to you in the last lesson of the tutor book. So I won't play that one again to you. Now the other piece that covers all the notes that you have learned in the tutor book is the piece Crotchety Crotchet and I recommend this piece to be played for the exam. It has the word Allegro at the top which means fast. You will also notice as well that you have some funny little dots underneath some notes. Now these little dots are called staccato and it means you play the notes nice and short. The contrast to this is the nice slurs which are written over the notes to play smoothly. You'll also notice too that you have a tied note to play at the end so make sure you hold that note on for six counts. to enter for the exam, to pass the exam you need to get 65 marks out of 100. Now if you play very well you may well get a merit and that is marked out of 80. Now if you live in Ireland the merit is known under the name of honours instead. And finally if you manage to play extremely well putting in every detail that I have mentioned, including dynamics and your staccatos and your slurs, then you stand a very good chance of maybe getting a distinction which is over 90 marks. I wish you luck with your exam and I look forward to seeing you when you start on the preliminary tutor book. <laughs>